the LSC Library, which holds the Women's Library Collection, and I'm talking to Gillian Murphy, who is Curator for Equality Rights and Citizenship. Gillian, can you talk us through some of these fascinating items you've got out for us today? Well, we hold uh, Emily Wilding Davison's archive, and she was a militant, a very militant member of the Women's Social and Political Union, the WSPU. So on the 4th of June 1913, she ran out in front of the King's Horse, and we have her race card here. Um, so she marked up the first race, but it was the third race that she ran out in front of the King's Horse, which is there. And she went to hospital and she died two days later. And we have here a letter from her mother. She was sent to the hospital, but she never actually read the letter because she never gained consciousness again. But the envelope says, please give this to Emily. But the letter is really heart rendering. So I feel I must write to you. I have, I'm in a terrible state of mind at the news which reached me last evening. I cannot realise that you could have done such a dreadful act, even for the cause which I know you have given up your whole heart and soul to, and it has done so little in return for you. And she signs it, Oceans of Love, Mother. Yeah. Um, so we also have um, some hate mail that was sent to Emily when she was in hospital. And this says, I am glad to hear you are in hospital. I hope you suffer torture until you die, you idiot. And it is signed, an Englishman. And we have her purse that she had, and her return ticket, and her insurance ticket, and a list of items that were found on her when she, when she ran in front of the horse. So there you can see her purse, her some flags, her race card. Thank you.